Hello everybody and welcome back to my time at Porsche where we are still trying to uh, give Gwyneth lots of presents so that she'll like us uh, and do lots of interactions and, and all the good stuff. Let's have a rubber ducky today. Because at, the, at this point I feel like Higgins is going to get ahead of Gwyneth when it comes to points. So... I'm just going to pet and kiss her until until the relationship points run out, I think. Until I stop getting points for it. Love and kiss and love and kiss. Get about 10 points. I wonder if there is like a maximum limit on this. Oh yeah, look, pet is now... I think you might be able to do like three of each. So if you can do three pets, three kisses each day for two each, then that's six, 12, plus feeding to 17, 27 points a day. If I do everything, plus talk. We didn't do talk, talk is one, so that's 28 points a day. So you can do 28 points a day, which is almost, uh, like, you get the same amount for giving H Higgins a chainsaw. It's ridiculous. But uh, some days, as I say, they might request a toy, and on those days, it's very easy to get some social. So and that's Gwyneth up to nearly, just into that uh, eighth heart, eighth star now, so that's brilliant. And we will have Higgins into his ninth star today, I think. He, no, it, sorry, just into his eighth star as well. Oh no, Mint wants something again. Honey. Honey, can you find some time today to play with? Yeah, Enjoy no the quality school. time. And just give him a kiss and that's like enough for this quest. It's ridiculous. Wish you'd give me that quest for... Gwyneth. But you never do because I've given her about a million kisses this, today. So he's clearly realising Nathan's getting left out. But that's because Nathan was the first born. He got all the attention when he was born. Doesn't look like we've got a house yet. Should we go down the harbour and see? I may, because I need to go down the harbour and get a mini drill anyway. Because I'm fed up of going, up, going out every single day to get like chainsaws. So we'll do a mini drill. Like I say, we've only got about seven more of them to buy. So that's three three shopping trips. Maybe four. Expensive mind. Someone wanted me to give him a vacuum cleaner, so I'm actually going to buy a vacuum cleaner. Um, and this might be a bit of a waste of a day, possibly. In fact, I'll buy the vacuum cleaner and the mini drill. But they were saying the vacuum cleaners were just as good, but then the wiki says that they're not. So it'd be really interesting to know. So I've just got so much money, I don't really need to worry. I've got 72,000. I think I'll be okay. So we can just like probably just ride Rover Rider across the, the sea, over to Yeye's from here. So it's not going to be too difficult. You don't need to jump to go over water, you can just sort of. Hover. It's a really cool thing, this. I love it. And we'll go to Yeye's. That's three presents for Higgins purchased. Um, but I, I think one of them, I think one of them is going to be a bust. But you've asked me to check it, so I shall do that for you. I'll do it today. Like I say, I was like, I'm not going to do it on Day of the Bright Sun because that would be a waste if it didn't work. Okay, so where's he is likely to be? He will, he usually is somewhere between his workshop and uh, his workshop and the Commerce Guild. It doesn't usually go anywhere else, really. Oh, you know where he'll be today, though? Church. That's the one day of the week he goes somewhere different. 
Mint clearly not a churchgoer there. But I know Higgins is. Hello. <laughs> Which is weird for a builder. Okay, so um, vacuum cleaner. Plus 10. So, yeah, like it said on the wiki, so um, it's not going to be something that's going to give you a lot of, uh, like, points with him. Like, if you... You can make vacuum cleaners in the factory. So if you don't want to spend the money, you cannot make a chainsaw. You cannot make a mini drill. So if you don't want to spend the money, then you can go with uh, vacuum cleaners. If you want to be quicker, like three times quicker, then go with the mini drills and the chainsaws. So it just depends. If you're like like me and you're at end game, you get all the Higgins quests and you're like, I want to do this fast, then just spend the money on it because you're at that point you're getting commissions that are like so incredibly lucrative. It's not going to cause you an issue to buy a chainsaw every day. Chainsaws are the best value for money. But if you can't be bothered going shopping all the time, then, you know, Right, so today is kind of a rubbish day. There's nothing to do. Nothing to do at all. Isaac desires something. Someone up in the church desires something. Other than that, there is nothing to do today. So, I'm going to go back to bed. Luckily, it lets me. Um, I was noticing in Sunhaven, if you go to bed before, before I think, 6 p.m. Or, so, or maybe even later than that, I tried to go to bed at 5 p.m. It wouldn't let me. I was like, what? So I'm just waiting, one day I'll wake up and, and the house will be done for Hoss and Tuss or there'll be some something in the mail for me. But like people have been saying, it's getting you're, you're getting thin on your quests, so it might be at this point you need to... Uh, scraps! You're getting in on the action there. Ah, oh, I see. But it might be at this point that um, we need to sleep quite a lot. I will be giving Higgins presents every day. I will be trying to get uh, Gwyneth to like me every day. And then we'll probably get to the point where we're at the end of the quests. And then I will move on to Pumpkin Days. Yes, you heard me. That's what we're going to do. It's going to be a mixture of Pumpkin Days. Um, I'm thinking that we might be getting towards the end of possibly some of the content on Sunhaven as well. I'm not sure how much is left there. I'm getting right through the mines on it. I'm getting... Uh, I've been now to, well, you're going to see soon, but I've, I've kind of been to some of the, the villages and stuff like that. I'm a little bit ahead on my recording at the moment, but I don't, I, I, I don't know how much more there's going to be. Oh, really, Mint? Honey. I'm going to ignore him. It's not part of my game plan, okay? <laughs> I know I mean. <laughs> If I don't take the date, then I don't lose points for forgetting it or missing it. So I'm just going to go and and see Higgins, get a commission. He's <laughs> waiting for the guild to open. Higgins is now my best friend. That's hilarious. So best friend is eight eight stars then. Eight, yeah. Best friend is eight. So we're on exactly eight. So that means we have exactly two hundred points to go. Might be like one or two over. Um, we have exactly a hundred points to go, which is exactly no two hundred points to go, which is exactly one, two, thirty, sixty, ninety. Yeah, probably a week Monday. Obviously, I missed a day. I missed a day with the... We're both waiting outside. We're like, we must get all the good commissions. Wooden pillars, which is annoying to do. Leather belts is annoying to do. A wicker basket is slightly less annoying. So I'll get my factory to make a wicker basket quickly, uh, hand that into Arlo, and then go back to bed. Or I might just go back to bed and then hand it into Arlo. I'm not sure which way around I'm going to do it. 
I might not even take a commission every day. Shock horror. Unless they're good ones. Okay, one wicker basket, please. Really, it needs worn fur. Does everything need blinking worn fur? Right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go up to the civil corps. And I'm going to order, um, like, so much worn fur. And leather and stuff. Because those poor llamas. I'll have to kill some llamas today for it. But I'm like, well, in the future, maybe it would be nice just to have the, the worn fur there already. So, I would like some worn fur. I need... 200. In two days. That sounds fine. Lovely. Anything else that I need? Not really. Do some fur. Some delicate fur. They could go into the, the, the mines for me and get some stuff, but I don't really think I need that. I, I, I wouldn't mind going into Ingle's mine, actually. Oh, look at Arlo, go. I love all the little quality of life things they put in. I like them training. Okay, so. An email about a park game then. Does see he, see how that goes? Might be an interesting one. Okay, so given Higgins is present, I have started on my commerce commission. Let's see if it's ready yet. Oh yeah, of course. It won't be ready because I need to go get the llama fur. Llama drama. Don't worry, I've got a commission. I've commissioned somebody to kill you instead. It's all good, right? If someone if you commission someone to do your dirty work for you, you haven't technically murdered anything, right? That's the way it works. No, it is not. All you're doing then is making two people responsible. Right, how much worn fur do I have now? I need 24, I think. 15. Nine more of you need to die. I think you sometimes, oh we got two off that one, nice. You sometimes need to get, um, you, sorry, you can get it off the pan bats. And there are now pan bats around. You used to get a lot of them in the tree farm if, you, if you're prior to the quest where you like sort of um, calm them all down. But if you're past that quest, then you can go to the somber marsh if you've got it open and you can um, fight a couple of pan bats over there. And there's sometimes a few up the top of here, like up, 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 up that way, up the top of that big hill. 24 yet? Yes. But yeah, having a couple of hundred worn for very, very useful. I really can't be bothered with getting, going and just basically killing llamas. That seems like very early game stuff to me. <laughs> I am late game, I don't need to do my own work. Okay, so let's... Uh... How long do I need to wait for it? 20 minutes, that's not too bad. So... We do 20 minutes. I could go and get all the stuff out of my box and sort it into the factory. That'd take a couple of minutes. 
Although I think today is going to be a very, very brief day. I could go and put away all those stupid, ugh, all those stupid relics. I did at one point have a relic box, yeah. anything the east in there I probably got a clothing box I mean should I should I try on my Hulu oh no it went in my relic box should I try on my Hulu t-shirt do you reckon I got one for furniture and stuff miscellaneous probably would be for furniture and wall lights and all these things that I keep getting given for, some, for no apparent reason but it's still got loads of food in there as well Um, no, I don't need to carry around milk anymore. I used to carry around milk quite a lot because of, um... Rape can go into the fabric box. That's looking a bit nicer. Um, but yeah, I, I did need milk in there for any time I came across Mason, but he seems to have stopped really showing his face anywhere. I think he's just gone to live in his little swampy house and I never see him anymore, so... <laughs> That's fine. That's what he wants to do. Right, the wicker basket should now be done. And then we'll give it in and head to bed. Maybe grab another commission on the way. One day I'll get this right. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, who wants this wicker basket? Someone down there. Hello. Um. Hello. So next, uh, we want to go to bed, I think. At two in the afternoon. Someone was saying like I've got hundreds of hours worth of sleep deficit to make up for. It is quite amusing. So yeah, I've done all of my uh, interactions I can do with Gwyneth today. I am determined though, because like it's so close. It's getting so close to 10 now. I'm like, oh, may as well. But I know that house hasn't been done and I know there's another quest that I haven't done and it's all Higgins' stuff and I think it's all being sort of gated behind each other but I've got no other quests and nothing else left to do left, so... Nathan is hungry? What? What? That'll be fine though because I can just feed him today. Oh, you know what it was? Mint picked him up again. That'll not be a problem because I get five every day for just... I, I feel bad, obviously. Obviously, I've got to feed my baby, that's terrible. But it won't be, it won't be too bad because I'll re regain... I'll regain the, the trust by making sure I feed him from now on. Even if I don't need the points. So, I just hate that. I hate that sound. It's like the sound of failure, isn't it? <laughs> I do have a little bit of mail today. From Albert. Okay, here we go. Gust and I are planning to show off the new Huss and Huss house tomorrow at three. We think since you and Higgins did so much of the heavy lifting, you should be in attendance. Hope to see you there. Albert. It's apparently supposed to be... Well, I don't know where the new Huss and Huss house actually is. Because they said it was an old house. But I don't know where... Well... Actually, they said it was their old house. I'm going to have a little look around today and see if I can work out the location. 
Did I still have a commission to hand in? No, I've done that. Okay. So we'll take another commission. Oh, I'll keep up with that Higgins bloke. Although, like I say, I could probably afford to miss a couple of days and not worry too much about it. I'm quite far ahead now. Leather belt. Oh, a colossal balloon. That'll do. Thanks, Isaac. Now Higgins has to take the one for the leather belt. He has to go and kill all the llamas. Although I'll have my, hopefully have my llama commission, my la my like worn fur commission that I posted. I'll hopefully have that tomorrow. And then I can start taking things like leather belts. Okay, so. One colossal balloon coming right up. Also, I don't actually technically need, um, I, and I just saw Higgins, so it's kind of annoying. Is he still in the Commerce Guild? Yes. I was just going to say, I can give him a, a, a drill today. I don't need to go buying all that stuff. Although we've now gone through the drill and the vacuum cleaner and the chainsaw so I could probably do with just going and buying another chainsaw and drill ready for the morning it also means I can just catch Higgins while, he, while he's at the cat uh, commerce guild which is quite nice so I don't know I don't know what we're gonna have to do um, once Huss and Tuss's house is built but I definitely want to make sure that I've gotten all of the stuff done and I think there is one more Higgins quest left and I think that that is probably going to be the end that's the only one that people have mentioned to me and I know I've got to do it and that will be all I will be doing it's a nice low market price right now fantastic if I was allowed to get multiples which I'm not then I would uh, totally I would totally buy a lot right now, but no, not going to happen. Okay. Harlow's out here checking things out, making sure everything's running smoothly. I'm just going to go and get a chainsaw, so then that's two more days worth of stuff for Higgins. I think I'll probably need one more shopping trip after this. Uh, let me have a look. Social, Mr. Higgins. Yeah, I've definitely got two more days worth for that star and three more days worth for that star. So we'll finish off the ninth star with what I've got in my inventory that I'll need to do another shopping trip and a half. <laughs> So it shouldn't take too long at all. Oh, I'm so pleased about that. Okay, so I think we're going to go to bed now. And then I, th I think it, this might be like one of the last episodes. I think there might be... I reckon we might have one or two more after this. I hope it's not feeling too sort of fragmented because I'm skipping days and things like that. But it really is at the point where we're running out of things to do again. So I just want to... But I do want to get all of these quests up and running. Do you want to get them all finished? So, we've given Higgins, Higgins his present. We've given our our kid a present. We've got a commerce commission to do and hand in if, if possible. Uh, let's see if it's done. Yes, it is. Let's go find Isaac and hand that in and then it's off to bed with us again. It was this morning that I had that letter, right? I'm losing track. Honestly losing track. Um, day 23, so day 24 will be when we'll... Yeah, okay. It's when the house will be unveiled. The 
going into the commerce guild then? I thought Isaac had asked for it. Oh, he's here. Hello. Your pa left again? Don't worry. He'll be back here again someday. Someday. A valiant effort, apparently. I got a flower scooper. Oh, how awful. Uh, awesome. <laughs> it is actually more junk, technically. Like, you, you get them all the time in Ingle's mine. Like, so many flower scoopers. They do actually have a name. They are called a trowel. <laughs> Okay, bedtime for me, and then we will go to the grand unveiling of Hossentoss's house. But I do need to try and find out where it is. That was one thing I was possibly going to do today. I'll do it in the morning, it's fine. I'll give Gwyneth lots of love and attention. Get everyone fed. It always takes so long to get out of bed. Feed. Present. It's going to be lots of dinosaur cars from now on, I guess. I'm going to do lots of pets and kisses. And uh, as I say, this allows you to get about 30 points a day with your child, which means that if you do this every single day, you'll get a star every three days. It'll take you about 30 days to get full uh, stars with your child. More if they, as I say, request a gift. No, sorry, less days, more points. I'm glad that they do have a limit on it because I was like, is this unlimited? Because that seems really buggy. But because it's a limit of three each, I'm like, okay, well, I'm happy just to do three. And a chat. Then we need to feed Nathan. And I am actually going to give him a kiss. Because he's my baby. And he deserves one. Okay, so it is another day, and it is the day of the grand house unveiling, so um, I've got time to wait. <laughs> this hopefully will be my fur. Yay! Yay, my delicate fur. Okay, let's see if we can find now. Um, well, I'll grab, I'll grab a quick commission because it's nearly eight o'clock. And then we'll see if we can find the location of Huss and Tuss's house. Because I'm slightly concerned that I won't know where it is when it comes to three o'clock. Now, I remember it being like... Out in the middle of nowhere, waterproof lamp, that's quite difficult. An emperor blue mackerel, that's even more difficult. Waterproof lamp it is. Asking for a particular type of fish, you can be there for ages. The master fishing rod does make it a lot easier, but it's still a bit of luck and I don't like relying on luck. Okay, so off we go. Now I think Huss and Tuss's house is across here somewhere. Like past the Bassanio Falls. I'm sure this is where we had the fire anyway. And I I think they said that they were going to repair their old house. So I'm just going to go and see if I can see anything under construction or anything along those lines. Oh. Wait for a good full charge there to get up the hill. There we are. I'm sure it was around here somewhere. So 
So it would be nice if there was some kind of house already sort of semi-constructed here or whatever that I could see. I'm a bit worried that we're going to get to three o'clock and we will have, uh, I will struggle to find the house. If that's the case, I'll restart the day. Because this is important. I'm sure it was around here somewhere. I mean, the other thing is that they might have given them... I mean, they're, they're working in the... Um, in the harbour, so they might have given them a house in the harbour. But I want to be there for the unveiling. I'm just not 100% sure, like... Where their house actually is. So, we'll we'll try. I feel I think it's important... That, uh, that we are there for that. So, uh, waterproof lamps. So let's go back to the to our place and, and check that out. And then I want to see if uh, maybe at three, if uh, maybe a, a little orange helpful circle will be on the map because otherwise I really don't think I'm finding their house. And like I say, if I then miss it, I can always restart the day knowing where it is, which would be quite useful. Okay, waterproof lamps. Let's go and see if we can make some. I can't remember whether they are a... In fact, it'd be easier for me to check the factory first, because if it is something I can just make... Oh, yeah. I seem to remember them being more difficult than they seem to be right now. And we need to find Higgins. In fact, finding Higgins might be the best thing to do because we can follow him. Because I think he's going to be at the grand unveiling as well. So I'll give him his present for the day. Why do you never go and look, in, look at stuff in the museum? I, I know the answer to that. You're too busy working. I reckon Higgins will eventually the thing is they can teleport so it's really annoying but we're at 1 o'clock now they said it was going to be unveiled at 3pm so the other thing is if uh, if Albert and Gust have started moving somewhere I might be able to follow them uh, to wherever it's supposed to be I'm slightly worried about this I'll go check on my waterproof lamps. How long are they going to take, I wonder? Fifty-one minutes each. Okay. I'll just leave them to it. That's fine. Yeah, it's like, why did no one tell... I mean, maybe someone has told me where the house is going to be, but I wish I knew. I also wish I had a quicker way of passing time. Can you sit on a bench to pass time in this? So that you can in some in some games. I can't remember if this is one of them. I play so many at this point. Okay, it's nearly time anyway. I'm looking forward to seeing this. Like I say, I've got a feeling it's more towards the Bassanio Falls area. I definitely did say 24th, 3 o'clock. Time is going very fast. So I'm really hoping that it will give me a helpful circle to show me where the house is because they have not told me where it is. <laughs> 
I think they planned, I mean, they said that, that they were going to refurbish an old house. Um, and I can't, and I think it was the one that burned, so. School's out. Yes. Porsche falls, stop. In fact, I might just take the, um. Oh no, I don't think I should actually. I think I should just go up there. Gosh, it's right the way up. Okay, keep going. I hope it will give me time to uh, to make it up there. You're on track. Yeah. I totally forgot where their place was, so... But it didn't show up on the map until like past three, so. Oh, is that their house? Oh my goodness. The Higgins, you did an amazing job. And it looks like he made them like uh, their own. Ta da! Beats living in the streets, wouldn't you say? Us, my boy, would you look at that? We're millionaires. No more bathing in the fountain for us. I think. I've got something in both my eyes. Aww. Higgins, Shelab, Albert Gus, you're all the bee's knees, a real set of cat's pyjamas. We'll treasure this place every day and night. Well, you should be thankful. Practically everything in your house was provided by the two top builders in Porsche. Let's go see. Let's go see. Well, our work here is done. I'll say. Higgins, you just said the top two what? Oh, you heard that. Ah. I just said we're two of the top guilders in Porsche, you know, you and me, always at the Commerce Guild, gilding it up. It should come as no surprise to you that we are known as guilders. I never heard anyone say that before. Yes, well, it's a very common term. Goodbye. <laughs> I want to know if I'm allowed in Hustle and Hustle's house. Oh, it's really quite basic, but it's full of pictures of fish. I like it. How do you feel I about get it, Huss? I to be bossed around by my angel. It's so nice. I get to be bossed around by my angel. See, I can't do like a photo with him or anything. But I can sort of do, stand next to Huss. While he's in his little house. I can take a picture of myself outside the Huss and Tuss house. Okay. Right, Robo Rider is still here. However, because there's a, a, a kind of handy DD stop, what I might do to be a little bit cheeky. A little bit cheeky. They are like out in the middle of nowhere, really are. Um, is to go back to the uh, Peach Plaza stop. Let the bus take me home, and then Robo Pig Rider will magically appear in the morning. So that'll be perfect. So I'm going to go to bed, and we'll see if anything shows up in the morning. I'll collect the waterproof lamps on the way, and we'll give them in. I think tomorrow. Or we could try and give them in today. I don't know. Well, they're done, so... Who are they for? A McDonald who is down in this. Okay, you know, this is why we have backup horse. <laughs> Lightning, otherwise known as backup horse. He's actually really fast. McDonald at his burger stall. You wanted to light up your burger stall? Or something for your farm, maybe?
so that way we'll be able to just head to the commerce guild first thing in the morning um, I do have a chainsaw uh, and a and a lamp uh, sorry and a drill but I've only got two of them left um, I actually don't even mind if I give Higgins my chainsaw and my drill I can always get new ones like I say we are very close to four more gifts I think four more gifts maybe five I want to see what happens in the morning if we get any new things from Higgins, whether he's got any new like ideas. He's definitely warming to us as we're in... And I feel like those quests might happen anyway, um, but he definitely like seems to be warming to us the more we're doing quests. And I think it's kind of fitting because we are really working on the relationship there. And it's pretty awesome. So let's see what happens in the morning, if anything. So obviously feed both babies. They seem to have decided to go downstairs and watch cartoons or something. That's what kids do when they get up before their parents. Didn't you know that? They get up and they watch cartoons. Picking up Gwyneth there. Gwyneth needs a, another dinosaur car because she doesn't have enough already. And... <laughs> Lots of kisses and cuddles. You're just trying to keep her, just trying to keep her up with the, with her brother, who is now a ten-star loved kid. These are the most loved kids in the world. He does kind of wish he could just like pet them once and get six points instead of three times at two each. It does seem a bit grindy just to be like pet, 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 kiss, kiss, kiss. But I suppose it does reward persistence. Yeah, I reckon three more days worth of very persistent gift giving and uh, and uh, it's definitely gone up a lot quicker since I started doing all the, the pets and, and, and all that sort of thing and making sure I chatted and la la la. So definitely three or four days off from doing, from finishing that. And we're three or four days. Now then, if nothing is due to be done today, then I will just go find Higgins. Uh, looks like I've got some post though. Let's have a look. Russo. And, uh, oh yeah, my, my fur, lovely. So I've got all the stuff in the civil core now. It's very, very useful to have all of that just hanging around. So it really is going to be a case of give Higgins his present. I am ahead enough that I could probably just get away with giving. Oh, of course the construction was a success. Timely, under budget and high quality. All thanks, of course, to yours truly. Oh, and you helped out a bit, I guess. Thanks. Well, no present for you, mate. Guess I'm following you in here, am I? I may as well pick up a commission at that point. What's this? A D rank commission. Yeah. No thanks. Wooden pillars, aluminium plates. That one is mine. You can take whatever you want. What's he going to take, I wonder? He took the worst one. No wonder you're behind, Higgins, <laughs> taking lazy commissions. Don't think I didn't catch you doing that. Have a chainsaw. Well, I'll get the aluminium plates on. I uh, will uh, do a quick round of uh, buying up chainsaws and mini drills. And then I think we'll go to bed and I will end the episode there. And then next time I'm just going to keep flicking through the days. I, I don't think this is the last one. I'm sure there's more questing to, to happen. And I'm pretty sure that what's happening here is that the all the other quest lines are kind of closed off at this point. And the Higgins quest line is kind of dragging behind. So I think there'll probably be a few days and there'll be something to do with that. So... 
Oh, look, they're working at the harbour. Oh, I'm so glad they came down here. Look at you go. So they were, for, uh, for a while, they were guarding the Commerce Guild, but once they got far enough through that Higgins quest line, Huss and Huss got their own... Oh my goodness, that's so cute. Got their own jobs at the harbour. <laughs> I love them so much. They're so cute. I love how everything sort of is wrap, wrapping up now, like Higgins is being friendly, Huss and Tuss are getting their own home and their own jobs and everything and just everything. And Toby, oh, sorry, Toadie as well. Toadie got his sort of, uh, so everyone's gotten their, what, what's it called? They've gotten their sort of happy ending, but the, it's it's an, it's another word. It's a word for like when when you're a bad person and you, you get, it's not retribution. I don't think it's another word. I hate it when I can't think of words. It's the worst. And I know that, and when I know that there's really specific words that means the exact thing I want to put, you know, to portray. And uh, I can't think of the word. <laughs> it's the worst feeling. Okay, I should have actually gone across to see uh, Ye Ye. And that'll be the last thing we do in the episode, I think, because then I'm going to be, as I say, it'll be next episode. Oh, I might need to just put on some aluminium plates as well when I get back. But um, that will be it then. I'll hand that in next episode. And as I say, we'll be then waiting to see if any other little bits and pieces show up. Yay, yay, so let's grab a chainsaw. It should be the last two or three gifts that I need to give to Higgins. So I think everything is just gonna like fit kind of neatly into place. It might be that these Higgins quests are actually like tied behind him being like best friends forever with me. So it might be that I have to. And that's that's why there's a few days between them that I have to get to the right friendship level with Higgins before these things start um popping up, which which might explain why they're taking a few days sometimes. Impossible. But we've given Higgins his present today. We've given uh, Gwyneth her presents and, and things today. It's going to be just a few days before they're all up to their 10th heart or star. No, it's stars for both of them. Their 10th star. Right, let's just check. Did I already put the alumin in aluminium plates on? I don't think I did. By the time I wake up in the morning, they will be done. So that's how difficult commissions are for me right now. They are extremely easy. <laughs> it used to be I had to run around the place getting loads of stuff for them, but no, not, not anymore. Now it's time for bed. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then do please leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more Portia, then please subscribe. I do think there's more to be done. I'm sure there's another quest that people have told me about that has not come up yet. So we, we do have more to do. And I'm going to keep plowing through, um, giving Higgins presents and things like that until we get him to best friends forever. And also until we get um, little Gwyneth, hopefully, to being... The happiest kind of child. This should be like the happiest child or something at 10 hearts. This should be something that changes. My goodness. But anyway, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you subscribe. And I hope you keep being awesome. 